Oh my god. Visible? Oh yeah. <laughs> Maitland, I think I got the shot. Okay, so we're heading back up on the mountain. See, I got the side by side behind me, taking it up there. Got some supplies. My family should be able to get over here Friday night and join me. And my son might be able to join me on Saturday or Sunday. So I'm looking forward to that. I hope they get here. We got some nasty weather kind of coming in. It's going to be cold. Maybe some sleety rain. So we'll see how that all plans, plays out, you know. Um, the winds today are awful. 23 degrees. Ugh, just awful. Here we go. First day of the general season getting stuff ready here I'm actually taking in my vario pack got a few extra coats it's 25 degrees this morning today is supposed to be okay but I like to stay warm gun is ready we are going to get up the the mountain got a few donuts in the belly um oh yeah I gotta put on my little neck gaiter just to help I hate hiking and getting too hot and I'll be sweating by the time I get there so I can get my hat too and I've really come to like putting my hat and actually clipping it onto my binoculars right here. So that's what I'll do there. Well, I probably look a little dressed up. <laughs> Even have my coat on hiking in here. Or these hats. It was hot. Got hot. Now I'm feeling cold, so you bundled back up. So, nothing. Come all the way in here and uh, see nothing. Not even a deer. No, nothing. Not even a noise besides squirrels. Nothing. <sighs> so. Sun's up a little bit. It's gonna get up to about 45 today. That'll help get a little bit warmer here. As I'm chilled. My sweat's chilling off is what's happening from hiking in here this morning. And so I'm just trying to stay warm. And uh, I'm gonna kick back here and sit in this location and watch this, these meadows for at least a couple hours. see it moves. Uh, at least there's an animal moving around. Man, if that would have been an elk coming through right there that wrecked his horns. Oh my god, that would have been freaking awesome. Okay, so you see these two UTVs right there? A couple side-by-sides. Don't be like these guys. So the road is up here. These guys drove over this hill. No road just down to another little bench just so they can get to another vantage point without having to walk too much. So 
will probably take off soon, I bet. But don't be like these guys. That's going to tear up the side of that hill, make a two-track that's not supposed to be there, kick up a lot of rocks and dirt and run the sagebrush over. There's no road there. Dumb. Get these activated. It's about that time. I think it says it's 26 degrees out there this morning. I think we'll get up to a spot and have another sit. I didn't see nothing else on the way out last night. A few does, so I had nothing to close out with very well. Came back, got a few hot dogs, ran the generator a little bit, and got into bed. So, get back at it today. Let's hope something changed from yesterday. The winds are supposed to be at least half of what was yesterday. It said it was around 20 miles an hour today. It's saying around 10, so hopefully that might make a difference. Well, good morning. So, got to my spot here where I could see a big portion of this draw. It's kind of a vantage point, more like. I could shoot something across from me here at 400 yards. Or down this ridge line. Um, but the other vantage point, it gives me a lot of views all the way through this. In the timber and in the aspens where you can't see it from nowhere else. So I'm watching it. It is a little different this morning. Let's see. The winds are down. As you can see, I kind of just have my coat wrapped around me because I was sweating on the way in here. It just gets you every morning. You don't put your coats on, you sweat or don't sweat. It's not as cold as it was yesterday. The winds are down, and that's a huge difference. Um, blue sky, some whisper clouds. I did spot three moose on a hillside two miles away. Hey, we're back out for our evening sit. So it's October 16th, about five, almost five o'clock right now. And uh, pretty decent. The wind is up, especially up on the ridges. It's moving. It sounds like a train up there. So I decided to stay down low. So I'll watch my meadows. Still got some sun on this side and shade over here. Didn't see nothing on the way in. Saw five deer from camp. Here's the meadows again. In case you need a little reminding of what I'm looking at here. You can see all that country. And then right into here you can see some open meadows coming out of the timber. Ooh, the wind's picked up. So and off the mountain, nothing. I didn't see nothing today. This is getting so disappointing. Some of this weakened pressure will move animals around. We're supposed to get some rain and sleep. Who knows what that will do. But two days and nothing. I'm a creature of habit. I just keep hitting the same spot over and over and over. So we'll see how it goes. Watch. Oh my God, he was right there. Get that on. Oh my God. Hear it? Yeah. Please say I got him. I had to do that so fast. Here, look at me. I had to get my scope cover off and get the safety. Mainly he was like 40 feet. Hey, you are looking, right? Like, yeah. is it looking at me? Yeah, it's looking at you. See if he's a. Uh, Oh my god. It was a bull? Oh yeah. <laughs> Malin, I think I got the shot. Now watch, you should see the cows run over right here. There's cows? Yeah. I didn't see They cows. all took off that way. Oh my god. Keep looking in case he goes across that field, but he went, okay, so he was right here at this little green tree, okay? And he cut right through there where we see those trees. Mm -hmm. So when we come down here and look, that's the way we're gonna go, okay? Okay. There better be blood right here. Oh my God. Oh. 
That was scary. Well, I saw, <gasps> I saw you go like. Boop, 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 boop. He was right there. He was right there. Oh my God, he's a good bull. <laughs> he's no. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> That's why you sneak. Does this mean we can talk loud now? Well, yeah. Those cows are gone. They look like I haven't seen them come out. So they probably went that way. They probably went through that timber. He went down through here. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, let's go down the tree right here. Okay, let's, hey, we still need to keep our voices down in case it wasn't a great shot. What we don't want to do is jump them up. Malin, you're not even pointing the camera at me. <laughs> Are you nervous? Are no, you shaking? I'm not shaking that much. Oh my god. I just saw you take your stuff off really fast and I was just like... <gasps> Can you like... That's why when I hit that spot right here, I was creeping. Because you just got to every little step, you could see a little bit more. He was looking at us. He was already looking at us. Oh my god. That scared me. I saw you take your scope cover off and I knew there was something, but I wasn't sure. <sighs> down here to this tree. Okay. That was scary. I covered my ears really fast. He has to be down in there. God, I hope he's down in there. I didn't see him run out anywhere. Mom and Mary are probably like, who is that dead shot? They probably did. Look at this back there. I almost thought about walking us through here. Like, look at that. We just couldn't even quite see him. Right there. They're coming right across this. Those guys weren't even, didn't even see him. Or they might have seen him. That's why there's two. And they couldn't get over here. Okay. Oh. He's right here, buddy. I hope I got him. I think I got him. And I went pretty quick because of how close he was. Oh, I, don't even have that scope cover on. I didn't even see him. I heard him take off though. I wish he would have fell down right here. I don't see blood right here. He was right in here somewhere. His tracks, he definitely went that way. Oh, why can't he just fall over right here? Dang it. I'm pretty sure I was on him unless he was so close that I went over. Wait, we got blood. We got blood. Whew. Yeah, we got blood. We went this way. Too. I know we, this is this trail right here, okay? Okay. I didn't even see him. You didn't see him at all? Did you see him run? I saw his horns, that's it. Hmm. And I heard him run. You know, I want to keep good boys. Here's some. Yeah, you know, there's blood. So he turned. I shot him on his left side. This is coming out his right side. That's good. But I wanted, I'd like to see more of that. No, he could, he went down. He must have cut down a little bit right here. Yeah. That fell all the way down this hill. Well, this is the cows. Yeah, this is one of the cows.
Here's a bunch. Here's, blood. Here's a bunch. That's a ton. Yeah. We're gonna get them, man. I just don't like seeing him first. It felt like he crashed into a tree. It sounded like it. Where do his tracks go? Right here. Yeah, he's not. I almost think we need to aim. I see some blood on this leaf here. Well, these leaves are pretty red too. Kind of. Is that blood or is that just leafy color? <laughs> see that? Blood. Yeah. So which way do you go? Down? Look, like your tracks right here. Oh, my dad right here, there's a bunch of blood. Yeah. And on that bush. Well, at least we have good easy tracks. Alright, let's be a little quiet though. I think you went up. Looks like you went back up. I feel like I smell them. I think we can see tracks. I need to look right over here, okay? Okay. Stay right here for a sec. Let me just look right here. Yeah, this way. Yep, I see blood on these leaves. You went right there, here. See the blood? Yeah, I saw that there was some blood back there, too. <gasps> I don't know if I can see him that good. <sighs> he looks huge. <laughs> Look at that, buddy. Oh, he's dead. He's upside. He's like upside down, actually. <gasps> Can you believe that? For two days on me. For two days. Camera's at me, bud. It looks it like is. you're down. For two days. I haven't seen an elk in here. You're good luck. I needed you here. <laughs> yeah. Man. Oh, my God. What did you, uh... Malin, 
What did you think was happening when I started? When I was getting my gun off Are real fast. Shoot? Did you? Like I had to get my. Mm -mm. Out of all days, I had my scope cover off, and it's just sprinkling, and I had it on. I had to get that off. I was getting it off so fast. I'm surprised he didn't run, because I could just barely see him. There's a little brush between us. Did you even see it at all before I shot it? No, I saw his horn tip. The, oh. And then I was like, then I, I saw there him take is. his scope cover and I was like this. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right oh my gosh. He's a good boy. <laughs> he's no joke. Oh my gosh. He's, he's dead. He made it maybe 80 yards from where we shot, maybe. Yeah, it might have felt farther, but maybe a hundred yards. Whoa. May May. No. Well, we'll see. We got a cow tag. Yeah. You still got a bull tag? And then they're now they're going down closer to our trailer. Well, who knows now? I can't even believe this. This is where we walk up every day. Yeah. He's a, definitely a six. <laughs> oh my god. Mainland, this is like almost the same spot that the cow elk were shot last year. I mean, it is. That log right there is, oh, there's skeleton of it right there. This is where Grandpa got his cow last year. For a link for that video, <laughs> I'll put it in the upper corner. He died in the same spot that my stepdad and my buddy ben, Mel got their cows last year. There's actually a skeleton down here. I see it. Oh my gosh. Here he is, boys. This is amazing. I said, well, boys, this is for people on the camera. Yeah, he... He kind of rolled some right here or something. So there's... Whew, he's a stinky boy. One, two, three. There might be five on this side and six on the other. Are you kidding me? And the shot definitely had to pass through. Especially when we were seeing blood on that trail. Definitely passed through. Oh my gosh. Boy, look at those horns. He's been rubbing. What's he been rubbing on so much? Oh, we got a little extra point here. He's like seven here. Yeah. Oh no, he's got six on this side. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh my gosh, he's a seven by six man. Oh my gosh. Can those guys see us up there on top? <laughs> there was there was one right up there too oh my gosh buddy now we got work to do yeah. though <laughs> unbelievable oh I wish you had to pack them out what you'll probably end up having to do is put a little bit extra on your pack and then um, I'll get I don't know what I'll get off first. I don't know. I got a game bag. We'll just start working at it. We'll start boning him out. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> I know this would be fun to just bring mom and Merrick up here. Just up the trail. Come to here. Mom could pack your mom. We might actually uh, do that. Mom might actually have to... Uh, <laughs> So you could pack your gun that way as a safety precaution, and we all have tags still. So you have, you still have a bull tag, cow tag. I have a cow tag, and mom has a bull tag. What if we got them all? Yeah, well, I doubt we're shooting five elk today. Oh my gosh. Let me get my gun off my shoulder here. <laughs> Malin! I got that offer. Everybody that's up there that's just driving around, not right down in here though.
Let's get this done. Where's my knives? I'm gonna need my knives. So it died in the same spot as the one last year? Yeah, see that skeleton? Yeah. Yeah, we had two cows right here last year. You killed two right here? Two. The guys were over there and they shot back over here. And the cows ran out of these trees right here. Isn't that crazy? Let's see. So there's this two skeletons? The, I think this is gonna be on the green license. Is there two skeletons? Well, yeah, there should be two. It's kind of all scattered. Okay. Oh my goodness. Let me figure out which one <laughs> it is. There's deer. Shouldn't even pack that one anymore. Here's elk. Here's elk. Creepy. Elk. There we go. This is when you get so many tags in Wyoming, you just pack them all so you make sure you're not missing one. <laughs> Except the bison tag's not in here. On the way back down, I can shoot cow. Good, but the problem is, you might be packing your gun. I don't know, we got two guns to pack out of here. I'm fine that's, with pack, I can pack mine. That's the problem, you might be. Because his head, I gotta figure out how to get it on my pack. Okay, so first I'm gonna sign here. Let's see, is that the landowner one? You don't need a landowner one. stuff on these things. Baby. Now mom's gonna make us. I a... can't believe how close he was. I cannot believe how close he was. Now mom's gonna make us go to um, Park City. <laughs> okay, there's a really bad signature. Get halfway there tonight and then stay the night and then come back tomorrow. Yeah, I doubt that. Okay, that's all I can do for the signature. That's awful. He's creepy. That's not a good pin for that. He tipped over the whole tree. I gotta get the knife out. I gotta edge the month and day. What is it? 15th, 16th, the 17th, right? 17th. There's another ranger up there now. Send up a flare. Boom. Damn it. Tell me I'll put them in this pocket. What are you looking for? Nice. So we got to get October hatched out of here. October. October. I just can't believe that after all season, I was just joking last night that this was the worst season yet <laughs> for hunting. Besides our antelope we got. Now we got two antelope. Now we got a bull elk. Now it's turning into our best season yet. <laughs> it was close to hinging on worst season yet. It was close. But I got an antelope. This makes it best season yet. <laughs> and you got the antelope. Your first year, this is clearly best season yet. Okay, there, October's out. I'm gonna try and save that in the that pouch. Where'd I just put that? Mm -hmm. Don't there. Put it back in there. Still got it. Uh, 
It's hard to do with everything with one hand. Okay, I'm dropping October into there. There we go. Okay. Now let's get our date. It is 15, 16, it is the 17th. The 17th. Oh, it's clear on the bottom here. Oh, and I'm already smudging my name all over. 17, here we go. Okay. Now, Mommy and Merrick, they're probably going to have to stay the night. Because by the time we get this all done the day, I need their help. But they're here. We might as well get their help. Ooh, I almost lost the 17. Now you want one like that? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, he's a solid bull, buddy. I'm going to I'm going to rate him at around a 3 320 315 310 that's what I'm gonna say I guessing you know he got some smaller fronts there his one on that one and two on the left side is smaller mm -hmm. got some pretty good girth on him though got some pretty good girth he's green probably find all his rubs in through here okay so I'm gonna put that tag back in the waterproof though because it's punched and as long as I'm packing him out, it can stay in here. <sighs> Keep it safe that way and don't lose it. Man, we ought to make sure your shooting sticks and everything are set up in case one walks out right there. <gasps> they come right around that corner. We need, we should probably actually keep our voices down. That could happen. It could happen. I'm not shooting one now. Why? Because you have to pack we'll him get out. a double. <laughs> no. <laughs> there he comes. Malin. What do you mean you're not shooting one now? You shoot one now, look. There's one take all day. We were at the back where we shot those cows last year and I literally broke my leg right down there. This doesn't make me <laughs> happy about that. This is bringing back some memories. <laughs> right there, right down there. That's where I broke my leg and I had to walk a mile out of here. We are not going to do that today, you got it? I'm not breaking my leg. Okay, good. There's no one. Eight. Eight thirty-six. So, okay, I'm gonna get started. So I'm just debating. I think I'm actually gonna be okay with if I roll this side over. I get the legs and everything off. Debone this whole side right here. Then I can flap it back over and literally roll him over. And with his head off, that'll work. Hey, watch it. Oh. Okay. Make sure that we're not getting too much stuff is getting wet here. We're gonna pack some of this out of here. Oh, did you see that tree? No. No. What? He covered it in blood. probably rolled over that tree. Fantastic, Mei Mei. Uh, there. Okay. See a cow, you're not doing that same thing again. Doing what? <laughs> oh, I can't believe he stood there long enough for that. No, I he can't covered that it. tree in blood. Huh? He covered that tree in blood. Yeah, he did. All the way up there. Well, he started rolling. Yeah. Okay. She probably did fall right there, rubbed right up against it. And see that blood that's coming out? It's making me think he's, he's been shot in the lungs, too. Mm, well, <laughs> yeah, look, the tree came right down. Literally see? 15 degrees out there. This is perfect. 40 degrees this morning. Blood amazing. everywhere. Just amazing. And the whole tree, even up here. Yeah, look, this tree lost a bunch of bark too. Yeah. Look, see the three lines? Yeah. The tree hey, rolled. If you start to get it cold, get your jacket on. Not cold. Pull your mask up. Yeah, he probably fell right there. That's, a, that's crazy that they were on the side. <laughs> this is heavy. So, the head off, we got one side with the hide off. We're gonna take this out, come back in for another load. 
We got family at camp, so we'll bring them back. But here we go. I'm gonna be walking like this all the way out. <laughs> That's how we're doing it. All right, here we go. I'm gonna film you for walking for a minute. Huh? I'm gonna film you walking for a minute. Make sure you don't fall in the video. I'll find somewhere. We got work to do. Good thing we didn't go home, Merrick. Come yeah. on. Oh, we got back to camp. And I want to see what this weighs on this pack. Because that was heavy. Man, I can't even get this pack up. Is it on? Oh, come on. said 64 then it went to full. <laughs> what does full mean? It means this is only a 50 pound fish scale. <laughs> Sometimes I know it gets just over 60 or something. Try it again. I've gotten over 70. Ah, 67. Full. Heavy. We'll go with like 150. <laughs> Yeah, it definitely had Seasley of 70 pounds with the head on there like that. A little sun, a little snow shower, a little hail, a little rain. Back in to get the rest of that bull elk meat out. 
I got that head out and uh, we still got some good weather you could probably see some black skies behind us though so we gotta get this done in the next few hours got them all so cleaning off this side of the elk we're now on to the left side and there was some weird coloration here like that's odd and i was skinning them down and look at this come in close look at that there's a broadhead in them here look at this broadhead whoa let's get this down on jeez oh That's man cool. it's definitely here back up a little bit oh it tore him up but it's right i, I could feel let's get this arrow out of here it's right here what I didn't really notice Careful. an entry wound or an entry. Gosh dang. Look at that. Oh, those are off the tip things like move. Yeah. Yeah, they're retractable. They expand when they hit. Somebody has shot this. <laughs> oh my gosh. And at that angle, somebody had to have been in a tree stand and shot that down. I mean, he could have been uphill, downhill. But the entry wound from right there should have been like right off the top. I wonder if that's where that bear spot was on his back for some reason. He's probably itching it. Oh. So he had a big bear spot on his hide. Here, let's see that right there. Oh, well. So this was right here, and we didn't know what this was. Back up the camera some, not too close. And uh, I bet you it itched, and I bet you he's been rubbing that. Maybe for a year. Maybe that is, Maybe that's not this year. But, ooh. Here we are, packing out some elk meat. We have another load to come back in and get. It's heavy. <laughs> Family's doing good. Get that trooper. So, weather's holding out. I mean, I can't believe it turned to blue sky when it said it was going to be raining by two or three. Crazy.